And now for part two of my Yeovil house tour. Okay, where we left off, I was in the backyard. Went back through the kitchen and now I'm into the living room. Now I'm going to bring you to my upstairs. I'm going to save the best room for last, which is where I have my question. Starting off with the guest bedroom right here. I plan on doing a little more with the hallway, but in any case, this one has a beach theme to it. Which, um, the frames in this one are kind of like my, my favorite so far because they have like a beach sunset and that's my ideal hypnotic scene. So. Okay. Going into the next room. There's not much to this one. I didn't really change it much to my other. Yeah. This is probably the only room that needs work. But okay. This just basically goes to the front yard. It just goes to the balcony. Oh wait, actually I have to go through my favorite room to get to the to one more room. But I'll leave that one as a surprise. So I kind of have to pan off to the side for a minute. All right. Here's another relaxation room. which has a nice little lounger with a beach themed wall that bears a picture of my dearly beloved which you'll find him on YouTube he goes by Mecca Rodan And just a little, um, this room isn't much either, it's just another relaxation room. Now, best, saving the best to last. This is my favorite room. This will be my hypnosis room. And see how it has my sunset beach for a view. spirally curtains on either side but the best part of this watch this watch the bookcase I'm sure a lot of you Yeovil fans would probably already know what this does but it's not what it does it's just how it looks now what I'm trying to do see if I can keep it still and this would kind of give you guys an idea of what I want to do with that. I want to try to make a video with that in it. Of course, trying not to stare at it while I make this video is kind of hard. Especially if I have to explain what I want to do. And then trying not to read that up there. Of course, I wasn't looking, but... Okay, what I want to do... And as you can see, I'm in my little chair. It just kind of looks like I'm staring at it. Hypnotizing myself. <laughs> but what I want to do is somehow make a video of this spiral. This particular spiral with just that in it. And make my own little video with my voice in the background and all that jazz. But I'm going to find that kind of hard. Especially when... It's, um, it's very small, and if I tried to close in on it, you know, it's just going to be very, uh, well, I don't know. You guys be the judge of just how hypnotic it looks, but then there's a glare on it, too, from the webcam. 
But I want to put that in a session somehow. Or just for a, um, a sample session for YouTube. For you guys to have a little visual. But anyway, there's me. Looking up at it, trying to trance myself with it. My Yeovil self, not my, my real self. But then, you know, things do happen. No, oh, if I'm making a recording, I can't do that right now. But there's one of those little Newton pendulum things. I always wondered why they would be so calming. I never really had one. But, but there you go. Now you've seen a tour of my YouTube, or you, uh, my Yovil house in my favorite room. You've seen me on this episode of Cribs. And this is me, June Yankee, telling you to get the fuck out. This has been an episode of Cribs. <laughs>